Guys, welcome back. Another one of uh, what I really like to call my favorite just got back from the mailbox trips. Uh, Battle Box. First of all, I'd like to say if all you're looking for is a video where somebody opens the box and tells you what's in it, you got plenty of other options. I come late to the party because I like to use all the stuff and bring a little bit more to these unboxings than just telling you this is what's in the box. I have been into and using everything. Let me see. Uh, everything. Uh, yeah, in one way or the other, I have used everything and have been uh, actually EDCing everything, but maybe these kick ass uh, sunglasses, which. Obviously with me, uh, I don't have contacts, so it's a minor drawback. Let's go through them. If you're uh, new to the channel, uh, Battle Box is a monthly subscription-based box of awesome. I, uh, I know, first of all, if you are new to my channel, then the one thing you need to know about me is I won't tell you I like something if I don't like it. Flat out, I, I have sent stuff back to businesses before because it's I, I don't want to see anybody uh, investing money in something if it isn't high quality and, and stand, basically stands up to what they say. Uh, BattleBox has uh, four different tiers. You can get their basic box, the advanced box, the pro box, and the pro plus box. And that pro plus box always gives you all of the tiers below it and one awesome knife and this month is not alone so let's just start with uh, the basic uh, the first thing is the Bastion Gear EDC Utility Aluminum Wallet that's what the box looks like uh, it is not in the box because like I said I have been using it it's a aluminum wallet and it uh, has some tricks up its sleeves. You have a flat blade screwdriver, F Phillips screwdriver, a nail file, and the bottle opener. And uh, this does work. Then on the other side, some place for uh, credit cards, driver's license, some cash. Uh, the reason that I wanted to uh, give, especially give that a try, is I have actually been looking for something uh, like this. And the first thing I was like, well, it's it's going to be big, it's going to be bulky, and it's not going to be comfortable. Well, I know everybody carries their wallet in a different fashion. I personally, after watching a documentary on uh, thieves, I no longer carry my wallet in my back pocket I carry it in my front pocket and after using this for over a week in my front pocket well at work not just when I can be more comfortable at home I have I actually have uh, no complaints uh, about it uh, next in the basic box is uh, Zippo lighter with the battle box emblem design on it. I I have not used this. I have uh, I have a ton of Zippos and uh, other than really large cigars, stopped smoking over a year ago. So uh, I have a good friend that happens to. Uh, have a Zippo fetish, and uh, that is where that is going to go. But it's Zippo, so you know the quality is all the same. It's just uh, you know what's what's on it as far as a cool design. Uh, the, the next and the basic is the Swiss Tech Utility Key. Um, well, I guess I can show you what the package looks like. Package looks something like that. 
It's a, uh, a six in one micro screwdriver, flat ba blade, bottle opener, serrated knife, Phillips screwdriver, and a straight knife blade. And uh, it looks like a key. Pops open, and all those items uh, micro screwdriver, regular flat blade, uh, Phillips, straight, serrated. And the whole thing uh, locks onto your keychain. Nice little positive uh, snap. Uh, again, uh, this uh, this uh, I'm not I'm not really uh, new uh, to the Swiss. Uh, on my uh, work my work and truck keys, I have uh, already have a Swiss tool. Uh, I really I really like these. They seem fairly uh, simplistic, but when you need it. It's there because you already have your keys. So that's in the basic. The next uh, is the Readyman uh, EDC belt sleeve. As far as full disclosure goes, this is the, uh, the one thing I have not used. And I do intend on giving it a try. I kind of like just spaced it out. Uh, it's something you would slide over your belt and give you the ability to uh, keep something else with you. Uh, in my particular scenario, I want to try uh, the magazine for my daily carry, my Walther PPS, and uh, just uh, you know spend uh, spend up on the job site. It's a, a smaller job site. If it happens to not stay in here or fall out and I don't hear it happen, it's not like I'm not going to be able to find it again and there's going to be nobody else to pick it up. So, again, the one the one thing I, uh, I haven't had the opportunity to try, but I intend on giving it a try. You know, it also may give you a secret location uh, for, say, a uh, cash or a credit card or something like that. Again, maybe you're in an area and you don't want to have a large amount of money in your wallet. You know, not all of us live in really great areas. Say you get robbed and you gotta you gotta hand over your uh, wallet, and you want to make sure that the uh, cash is somewhere else. Another possible uh, option uh, for that. Uh, and then they also throw in the uh, Readyman uh, Basic subscription in with the Basic. Now we step up to the Advanced. The Advanced is all that plus. Uh, we got the Smiths uh, sunglasses. Uh, These are the uh, Hudson Elites. I uh, also am not new to Smith products. I uh, am, was, a downhill uh, skier. And the Smith's goggles are the finest of the goggles I could find. Again, I, uh, I find them to be uh, comfortable on my, uh, on my face. The, uh, the downside is I, uh, I wear glasses right now. I've been looking into uh, uh, LASIK, but I haven't pulled the, uh, pulled the strings on that yet. Um, yeah, it's not going to focus. Supposedly they have a, a ballistic quality, but I'm sorry, but anything uh, moving at that speed coming near my face, I guess it's better than uh, absolutely nothing at all. Uh, next is the uh, Battle Box uh, Larkin Tactical Pen. I have used this as a pen uh, just to see how it writes, but I have not actually carried it on me in its uh, tactical uh, fashion. It can be used as a, a defensive uh, tool. And then when you uh, want to use it as a pen, you're all set to go. They have O-rings. gives it kind of a, a positive uh, lockup when you uh, screw the cap onto the back or uh, screw it over to the pen. Uh, it's a, a refillable. I, uh, I have not opened it. I believe it's a, a Parker refill that goes in there. And that is your advanced uh, box. Now you step up to the Pro. And again, 
everything you see, uh, plus the uh, Olight. Again, it's open because it has been in use. Uh, I'll I'll be honest when I say you know I have uh, I have all I have all sorts of flashlights. Uh, you guys that follow me know I review flashlights for two different companies. Both of those companies uh, encourage me to purchase their competition and go head to head. So all of a sudden one turns into two, turn two turns into four. So when I saw this light, I was like, you know what? For the most part, it's like it's like all the rest, but but I, uh, I was wrong. Uh, it has, like, like most of them, it has all sorts of features. You have uh, Firefly, low, medium, high. Then uh, you also can get to different features uh, by uh, like a double press of the tail cap. Uh, gives you uh, high, uh, the highest setting, which is a thousand lumens. If you uh, you can, you can click it and leave it on. Otherwise, it's uh, mo the momentum. It's memory, so whatever you are using it for last is what you'll get the next time you turn it on. Uh, you can uh, once it's on, you can press and hold the tail cap and get to that uh, annoying on uh, film uh, strobe feature. But again, a good defensive thing. Otherwise, you can uh, oops, hit the back three times and it'll go to it. So there's various ways to get to the features. But what sets this one apart from say this one? You know, I immediately looked at it uh, when I first opened it and went, well, right off the bat, that's probably gonna uh, the bezel on this is probably going to tear the crap out of my pants, but I noticed that the Olight gives you the option to adjust the pocket clip for either up or down, which as of this moment in time, I have not had the opportunity to look at, use, or review a light that had that option. So I'm able to carry it like this in my pocket and I have a lot better chance. I know it's still eventually going to happen, but in comparison to that guy, which also would serve as a defensive uh, weapon, uh, someone comes at you and you uh, give them a, a quickie uh, with this in the face, you're going to get their attention. Thousand lumens, uh, Olight uh, ships this with their battery. I have one of mine in there. I prefer the 18650s because you can recharge them, which BattleBox has you covered. They did send uh, the charger, which I've used, a nice uh, wall charger. You can do one or two 18650s at the same time. That is in the uh, Pro. And uh, then you also get the Red, Red, Readyman Premium subscription along with that and that rounds out the uh, basic advanced and pro and now when we step up to the pro plus uh, again you guys that have followed me I recently received a very awesome knife from uh, uh, Bastion and this one is definitely just as just if not more cool than the other one Again, they have cool, cool containers, at least as far as if it's going to be a gift for somebody uh, or, or not. Uh, this is the Bastion Gear Braza EDC folder. This one was made by them for BattleBox. It's D2 steel. And uh, again, I have been carrying it, so if it has a little dust bunny action going on it, this this is just one of the easiest opening knives that I have. As a matter of fact, uh, it has a detent that that gets you to that, and all you need is just to get past that detent, and you're out. You go. Uh, it is uh, titanium coated handles lanyard hole, pocket clip, it 
razor sharp uh, beastie. Now, I say that because some people are all into as light as possible. I personally like a knife that lets you know that you are carrying it. I am very impressed with the knives from Bastion so far. And if you want one of these, you need to get it from BattleBox. So, that is their EDC. And of course, they send along some uh, coupon offers. Uh, uh, Olight, uh, BastionGear.com, and uh, some uh, reading material from uh, Zippo is also in there. I think when it comes to uh, basically uh, if you had nothing and you were looking for your good uh, basic high-end uh, EDC uh, battle box uh, definitely has you covered with the Mission 25 Gear 2.0. Like I, the the one disappointing thing is uh, is the sunglasses. I need to make a I need to make a determination if I want to look into uh, Lasix. I pretty much do not want to go back to uh, contacts. I did not have a great experience on multiple levels with them, and uh, and like uh, a lot of the times, Battle Box, uh, you know, their packing material is flammable, so. I save, I save every chunk of it in a bag, uh, just in case I am going to need it. So, okay, guys, I'll have all the information uh, down uh, below. Uh, once again, I uh, I cannot be more truthful when I say uh, the boys at BattleBox definitely do their research and try to make sure that they are putting the best of the best in their boxes. This uh, this particular month, if you were to take MSRP prices, and I know I always get a couple guys that are like, oh yeah, but I can find that a lot cheaper. You, you, you probably can find some of this uh, cheaper. But having said that, uh, the Pro Plus box is $149.99 and First of all, the cost of this knife alone is a is a hundred and thirty dollars. You're not going to be able to uh, you're not going to be able to get all this if you're if you're looking at this and going, yeah, I'd 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 use I'd use ninety percent of that stuff or maybe even a hundred percent of that stuff. Uh, you're looking at uh you're looking at over four hundred dollars worth of stuff. And if you would have uh, signed up for uh, Battle Box, uh, you could have got everything for one forty nine ninety nine. So. I always look forward to seeing this on my porch. So, okay, guys, if you have any uh, questions or comments, please leave them down below. Happy to answer uh, anything. Uh, other than that, uh, check out BattleBox and get involved in their monthly missions. This one is very impressive. Okay, guys, Ibomi out here.
Oh, 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 oh,